Hello, my friends. Did you miss me? That sounded like an abomination of Super Mario and Putin. Well, we're off to the Q&A today. And some of you were asking for my daily rants, which are now bi-weekly rants. Sorry. <laughs> what did I do? Well, I didn't get a haircut. And I didn't improve on my sense of humor, apparently. Obviously. Well, what happened is that um, I got a new computer and I started learning how to code and I got completely absorbed by it. It's insane. I didn't do anything else for the last two weeks besides learning how to code. That's how I work. When I get really into something new which fascinates me, then I do nothing else but that thing. And um, I forget about everything else. I forgot my own birthday once. Oh, well, it's a lot of fun. I love it. It's a great new challenge and um, the markets have been not so kind two weeks ago. This week is, this week went much better. Besides that, it's just the same as always. Work, 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 work. And um, I got this new cup here, which is quite amazing. It has a suction on the bottom. You see when I press this down, then you can't push it over and um, it's just genius and then I read the Amazon um, reviews on that there was a one star review from one guy saying that he burned his hand and he's now in the hospital I have no idea what he did with that thing but if you're ever bored read Amazon one star reviews pure gold man I can still remember that was one <laughs> there was there was there was a review of a chair and one guy wrote a one star review and said uh, the chair smells so bad, so weird and then another guy answered well then you should watch, you should wash your ass <laughs> hilarious man, absolute killer there are a lot of comedians out there you know <laughs> having a great time what else, yeah uh, Tomorrow I have to drink a lot, the day after I'm flying to Singapore with a huge hangover, that's gonna be horrible. I'm gonna do some business meetings there, meet with um, Ray Barrows, do an event with him. It's gonna be it's gonna be great, um, promoting Edgewonk. One week later I will be back in Germany, then I have to look for an apartment in Frankfurt finally, because um, yeah, we, as I said, we are going to move our office there. It's just really hard right now because the, the, the housing market in Frankfurt is really like the bubble index is it, it's, it's quite high on the bubble index, and um, I mean Hong Kong is like a three, on a scale from minus five to plus five, and Frankfurt is like zero point eight or so. So it's still okay, but uh, it's not easy. But anyway, challenges, challenges challenges. So I hope I can make another video in Singapore if I survive the flight because like I it's, it's gonna be a nightmare. I did that once. I flew from Beijing to Moscow with a high hangover uh, with uh, Aeroflot and <laughs> for breakfast they had fish pudding. I threw up all over the guy in front of me. That was that was epic. So what else happened? Well, you heard about Russia, all that bullshit. It's a... Uh, what can I say? It's a gigantic choke. What the governments are doing there, the escalation politics, it's just a nightmare. And Conor McGregor freaked out. Besides that, not a lot happened the past two weeks. Besides me starting to play Escape from Tarkov, which is like a military shooter simulation, it's a lot of fun. Much better than Fortnite. Besides that, I still love Play Unknowns Battlegrounds. I'm a I'm a I'm a sucker for realism when it comes to video games. Um, yeah, simulations are the most fun, definitely. But anyways, enough of the ranting. I will think about a topic for a video when I am flying to. Singapore in zombie mode 
What I usually do on long flights like these is I think about pickup lines. I can do that for hours. But this time I will think about a topic for a video which might be a bit more productive. Especially because of the reason that I'm so out of shape right now that not even the most platinum pickup line could save my ears from getting busted. <laughs> By the way, if any of you guys are in Singapore, shoot me a message on Twitter and I'll make sure to buy you a beer. Have a good one, see you soon.